It's Troop here, Bike Man Performance. Today we're gonna do something cool. We're gonna run a prototype throttle body. Now, if you can see the difference in these two throttle bodies, uh, one is uh, quite a bit larger than the other. So let's flip it over here and you can see the size difference. Of the two so everything's about the same but the throat gets way smaller on the stock one so we're gonna run this and I'll show you what happens so hopefully it's a good thing okay, we got the printed throttle body installed it's in there we're running everything's good so far we're gonna go through this is the old uh, stuff on the graph we're gonna go in and see what this baby does working good so far Printed throttle body, who would have thought? About the same. Let's go into uh, a few more runs here and then we can actually make a good good deduction if it's better or worse. It's doing about the same. Uh, no, it's even down a little bit. It's running richer, so uh, might have to adjust the AFR a little bit to run the big throttle body. here is, is uh, not better than stock but our AFR is quite a bit richer so I'm gonna hook up the airflow meter I didn't hook it up because it's a little bit bigger in diameter uh, so I'm gonna have to stretch that on there I'll show you what I got going on out here so you can see the throttle body in action all right so let's go out here I'm gonna turn off the fans quick here all right so we're gonna go out turn off the key Now, we'll come over here. So this is how I got it set up so far. The throttle body is in there. See, printed throttle body running. Pretty crazy. So now I just gotta stretch this beast down there. All right, right we got the air meter stretched into place. We'll go into some more runs here. Now we're going into a little bit of the behind the curtain, how we actually change mapping so we're not going to show you everything but uh, we do it in binary we do it in the raw form uh, we don't use the pre-made stuff so uh, that's one thing that might set us apart from the rest of the folks so all right we're going to load this in the ECU and we're going to fight this thing all right we got the new tune in there uh, it's running big throttle body prototype we're going to see what this thing does Over here, and we'll see what it is. 
I actually doing? I mean, it's not monster gains, but it is more than it was. We're uh, 352.7. Right there. So, going a few more. The AFR did exactly what we wanted it to, so that's good thing about uh, getting used to this tuning and uh, turning the engine on. We can, we can do it with relative accuracy. This is the first attempt, so... that it's not any happier with the throttle body and uh, I'm not saying a throttle body isn't a good improvement it's just not a good improvement for this package uh, and I would have thought that this package would have uh, really liked it since it's uh, a bigger bore and a, a free-flowing head so uh, next step from here is we're going to put on the air extreme uh, plus one intake and the plus four exhaust valve. We're gonna run that with uh, the 430 lift cam and the 460 lift cam. So, like I said, this is Joey, Bike Man Performance. Make sure if you like this content, you like it on here because it really helps the channel out and uh, shows me what you like. And if you want me to try anything else, write it in the comments. Uh, check out all our cool stuff at bikemanperformance.com.